Today, I'm going to show you how to make the classic macaroni salad. So beautiful, it's so festive, colorful, a feast of flavors. Yung iba kasi nag-open sila ng gifts kapag Christmas Day. Kami hindi. As in, Christmas Eve pa lang. Pagkabigay na pagkabigay na. Bukasan na talaga ng regalo. As in, ang kapal na mukha ko kahit na hindi ko nino o ninang. Nakaginginong ninang talaga ako. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Bea's Kitchen! Yes, it's another cooking episode for me and I'm so happy na isushare ko sa inyo tong recipe na to dahil magpapasko na naman. This is our go-to dish tuwing magpapasko. It's a very easy dish. It could be a side dish, it could be a main dish, but hindi magbabago yung fact that it's a very delicious dish. And today I'm gonna show you how to make the classic macaroni salad. So these are the ingredients that you're going to need. We have here cheese, ham, pickled relish or sweet relish, anything that you want to add, carrots, also raisins and onions and tidbits of pineapple and nagboil na kami ng chicken here. Later, hihimayin natin kasi we want it to be really ano, no? small, parang bite-sized na siya. Iba siya na chop but ako parang gusto ko pa rin yung classic. Talagang pinupull ko siya isa-isa. And we have here uh, macaroni pasta, of course our mayonnaise, pepper, sugar, and also salt. Shall we start? Siyempre, we have here boiling water. Nag-boil na tayo kanina pa. Of course, grab our pasta. And then some salt. Of course, kailangan din natin ng oil. Some oil para hindi siya masyado mag-stick together. No? And then, let's put in our pasta. Stir it a little. And then wait for like, well, depends on what type of pasta you bought from the store, no? So, importante na tignan yung instructions. But for this one, it'll take us like less than 10 minutes. While we are waiting for our pasta to be done, I'm going to grab my chicken at ipapull na natin yung chicken natin into small strips. Siyempre, kailangan ng gloves kasi hirap na merong COVID ngayon. Let's protect each other. Pero dati, nung bata ko, ito yung ginagawa. Diba, mahilig ka siya. Siyempre, habang bata ka, mahilig ka tum tumulong sa mga matananda sa kitchen, ba? Diba? Ito yung pinapagawa sa amin. And I love doing it kasi parang feeling ko may saysay ako sa kitchen. Ito, tsaka kapag lumpia yung ginagawa namin, kami nagbabalot ng lumpia, and I loved helping out sa kitchen. So now it's done, we're gonna set this aside. Excited na ako magpasko, although hindi pa ako nakakapag-decorate ng bahay, but I'm so excited to do that. Let's be creative this Christmas. Now that our pasta is done, we shall strain it. And then, don't forget, always had to put cold water para yung pasta would stop from cooking. As I said kanina, it's a very easy dish. So, all we need to do now that our pasta is done, combine all the ingredients together. Ganun lang siya kasimple. So, probably we'll start with the mayonnaise. Dunk it all in. Trivia, alam mo yung brother ko, hindi siya talaga kumakain ng ano, mayonnaise. So, hindi siya kumakain na to. Diba, like ako, pag nagka-fries kasi ako, gusto ko yung mayonnaise tsaka ketchup. Yung brother ko, hindi niya ma-imagine. Like, diring-diring siya dun sa thought na may mayonnaise. But I love mayonnaise. I think yun ang ano, diba, karamihan sa mga Pilipino tayo, diba? Mahilig tayo sa mayonnaise. Pero in fairness, Kumakain naman siya ng tuna sandwich or chicken sandwich. Kapag nagtutuna sandwich kasi kami or nag-chicken sandwich, for it to be creamier, nilalagyan namin siya ng ano, boiled na egg. So, kumbaga, dagdag ano. Pero di ba, mayonnaise is made of egg din naman. Redundant, but it's good. <laughs> Let's put the chicken. There you go. Okay to lalo na pag Christmas season, it's good to have this inside your fridge so that kapag may bigla ang mga bisita pumunta sa bahay 
or it's also good to send to friends kasi nga kagaya na sinabi ko parang it could also be a side dish like if you have roasted chicken some protein right and then we're gonna grab our pineapple and then um our carrots relish ang dami talagang nakalagay talagang masarap happy fiesta na happy fiesta tayo I love it. There. And then, ito optional ah. Kasi ako gusto ko talaga ng raisin sa, ano ko, sa macaroni salad namin. But others kasi ayaw nila ng raisins. Parang yung brother ko ayaw rin ng raisins. So magkaiba namin talaga ng taste ng brother ko. Of course, we're gonna put our pepper. And don't forget, of course, salt. And a pinch of sugar. Not too much. Ako hindi masyadong... Mahilig sa sobrang tamis na macaroni salad. Later na natin, dagdag yung cheese. Now, we're going to combine everything together. Ito na yung cardio part, Charlie. There you go. It's so beautiful. It's so festive, colorful. A feast of flavors. Sarap nito pag malamig talaga. Yes. Galing sa ref, di ba? As a kid, talagang ito yung inaabangan ko. Lalo na leftover. Galing sa ano, diba? Noche Buena. Pinag-aagawan talaga namin itong magpipinsan. Laging kasama ito talaga sa Noche Buena namin. So at this point, we'll add our cheese. There. Yung iba kasi nag-open sila ng gifts kapag Christmas Day. Kaming hindi. As in, Christmas Eve pa lang. Pagkabigay na pagkabigay na. Bukasan na talaga ng regalo. Hindi kami, nag, hindi kami naghihintay ng Christmas Day. Christmas Day, kadalasan, naglalaro kami ng kung ano-ano. Like, we play cards. Mahilig kami yung mga ungguy-ungguyan. Ganyan. Alam mo, ito yung magandang experience. I may mean, magandang memory ko kapag Christmas Day. Nagbabahay-bahay kami dati sa tagig. Tapos nang namamas ko kami sa mga tao. <laughs> Tapos, kasi nag-iipon talaga kami para pang Enchanted Kingdom namin. Kasi yun talaga yung tradisyon ng pamilya namin. December 26, ever since nagbukas talaga yung Enchanted Kingdom, talagang ano, nagpupunta kami, dinadala kami ng tito namin doon. Kasi yun yung reward namin sa pag-ikot sa buong tagig <laughs> ng 25. As in, ang kapal na mukha ko kahit na hindi ko nino o ninang. Nino o ninang ng pinsan ko, nakaginginong ninang talaga ako. <laughs> Pinapayagan naman kami ni Mama para ano, Para makapag-ipon nga kami, para makapunta kami. Siyempre, wala naman si Mama pero na pang Enchanted Kingdom sa akin. So, na na nangyayari lang sa buhay namin yung tuwing December 26. And I remember when Enchanted Kingdom opened, yun yung first year na nag-open yung Enchanted Kingdom. Nandun ako sa pila, kasama ko si Kuya Cesar, yung tito ni Mama, na isa rin sa mga nagpalaki sa akin. Su super fan kasi yung tito ko na yun ng uh, PBA. And at that time, sobrang sikat yung Alaska. So, ang coach nun ay si Tim Cohn, di ba? I remember, nakatila kami, sasakay ako ng carousel, ang haba-haba ng pila. Tapos right next to us was Tim Cohn with his daughter. Nahalos kasing idad ko lang yung daughter niya. So, it was such an exciting moment for me. Like, sobra kaming, ano, fanatics. Kasi, nanonood ako, I remember as a kid, nanonood ako ng PBA because of my tito. And at that time, it was so big. Sina Alvin, Alvin Patrimonio, Paras, lahat yan mga, like, super, ano, super big stars of basketball. And just like that, our macaroni salad is done! Now we shall plate. Ang favorite ride ko sa Enchanted Kingdom was Flying Fiesta. And yung Space Shuttle! Oo, oh, oh, tsaka Anchors Away. Mga favorite ko before. Kasi dati, talaga matapang ako sa mga rides, rides. Pero ang ayoko lang talaga, hindi mo ako mapapapasok ng Horror House. Pero dati, naalala ko sa London, hindi ko alam pumasok ako sa Horror House. Akala ko parang it was just like some badui thing. And then parang peer pressure, pumasok ako. Parang naalala ko yun sa ilalim na Madame Tussauds. Oh my God! Akala ko mamatay ako. Para siyang slaughterhouse. Yun yung peg no ano, mamatay talaga. Tapos nangyari rin sa ano yan, sa Universal Studios, Singapore. Halloween, my God. Not only one, but, ano, dalawang horror houses yun. Pinunta, grabe, mamatay-matay ako. Hindi ko siya tinapos. Kasi I think there were like five or more horror houses na papasukin ka. November 1. Girl, as in, sobrang, kala ko mamamatay ako. 
So, no to horror houses. Kung gusto niyo ako i-challenge, yung matindi na talagang tatanggihan ko, yun talagang ano, horror house. So, kung masama kayo sa, sa akin, comment down below kung gusto niyo gawin ko yung horror house challenge. For extra color, you can garnish it with carrots or spring onions. And syempre, dahil I'm very cheesy, I like more, more cheese. More cheese, more fun! Actually, alam mo, kahit sa ano, fruit salad, naglalagay ako ng cheese. Tsaka gusto ko sa fruit salad ng cheese. Yung talagang ganito, eh, parang cubes. Tsaka for me, pag nakakain ko siya, parang treat. Kasi, uy, nasa akin yung cheese. Now it's done! Feels like Christmas already. Mmm, 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 mmm. It's good. You try this at home, and you will have a happy home. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. Do not forget, life is beautiful. Bye!